Bro, I have such a love-hate relationship with this topic. One, because this is the topic that really blew me up on TikTok and I love talking about it. But two, the, the part that I hate about talking about this is how ignorant people are and how they act when we do start talking about these things. But you know what? It is what it is. I'm going to talk about this today. Okay, so right out the gate, we have six different forms of these. And before y'all start saying it's a third world thing, I literally, I'm about to drop so much information on y'all. Number one is giardiasis. You find that one in contaminated water and food. And yes, we have it out here in America. This is the one that caused abdominal pain, diarrhea, all that type of stuff. Nauseousness, the cramps, all of that. And let's not forget the extreme bloating. Number two is cryptosporidiosis. This is also uh, found in contaminated water and food. Now, this the one where you get extremely dehydrated and a whole bunch of fever. Like fever fever. Number three is toxoplasmosis. Now, this is the one that's found in meat, soil, and cat feces. This is the one to where you get the flu-like symptoms and then your actual lymph node starts to swell. It even goes as far as giving your eye damage and brain damage. Number four is trachomoniasis. Now, this one is a STI. So you start getting all the weird discharge, the itching, the irritation, etc. Number five is ascariasis. You get this one via roundworm. It is predominantly found in uh, contaminated soil, and it kind of does the same as uh, options one, well, options, <laughs> infections one and two. The only difference is you get intestinal blocking. That, that's the real severe part about this one. And last but not least, number six is hookworm. This is another one caused by a different variation of roundworm. And this is also another one that's found in contaminated soil. Now it does a lot of, it has a lot of similarities to the last one we just talked about, but this one you get extremely fatigued. It drain, it literally drains the vitality out of you. Now here are the 10 corresponding states in the United States of America that has these things or have these things, I should say. California, Florida, Texas, New York, Arizona, Georgia, Illinois, Pennsylvania, Ohio, and North Carolina. North Carolina. If y'all know that song, y'all know that song. Now, keep in mind, the data is constantly changing, but I got this information from the CDC. So everything I'm talking about can be found on the CDC website. But now it's time for me to answer your actual question. You have to fast and detox. And I'm talking about like really get on a nice wet fast. I wouldn't even eat solids. So you're going to alternate between vegetable juice and fruit juice just to make sure you don't have any crazy detox symptoms. And on top of that, follow all of that up with a good bit of herbal supplementation to where you can fight all of this infection, all these other things off. And on top of that, a lot of prayer and meditation because that matters as well. And y'all look, I don't have enough time to talk about it how I want to. And if y'all don't even know where to get started, I have a seven and a 10 day protocol for y'all. So y'all can never say Coach Brian ain't never did nothing for y'all. But all in all, I hope this helped, friend. God bless. And thank you for allowing me to talk about this. It's been almost a year since I've talked about something like this because of these TikTok people. 